Hi everyone, I'm Michelle. Welcome to our channel, Raising a Disney Princess. Um, I am normally a mother-daughter duo, but I am alone today because it is Small Shop Saturday. Um, we are so pleased to join Thomas from Stitches Ohana in his endeavor to bring more awareness and bring more business to small shops, whether they be online or um, mom and pop brick and mortar shops, local businesses. and. This is something that's really important to Chris and I. Um, we've always felt this way, but especially lately, we are aware of many special needs parents, especially single moms, that uh, rely on their little small business, to, their small business to keep themselves afloat um, while they can stay home with their children. I mean, especially during COVID. COVID, small shops were so vital and so important for people to survive. So that's why we are really, really glad to join Thomas on this. I will be sure and put Thomas's information, his um, channel in the description below. Please be sure and check him out. He is so awesome. Um, as well as his Small Shop Saturday video and if there's anyone else involved in this collab this month, he'll have that listed. I'm not sure who they all are so I don't have them listed uh, at this time but please be sure and check out Thomas. It's, it's, ama it's an amazing effort. Just really, really proud to be part of it. Um, Thomas picks a, um, a subject or a, um, a theme for every month. And this month is mugs. And I got really, really excited when I found out that this month is mugs because I love a particular small shop when it comes to mugs and tumblers. I am talking about Lisa over at Sunday River Tumblers, and I will most definitely be sure to put her information in the description below. You can definitely get a hold of her through Instagram, and that'll be linked there, as well as she just started her brand new Etsy shop. She doesn't have a whole heck of a lot of stuff on there yet, but it is coming, um, and she's, you're just not you're not gonna wanna miss it. She's just absolutely amazing. Um, she is going to be giving me a coupon code for you all to use once the um, Etsy shop gets more established, once she gets more product on there. So be watching for that. We'll definitely let you know when that happens. In the meantime, it is gonna be my pleasure right now today to show you a handful of the mugs that we have personally gotten from her, um, including a new one that I just purchased that I just opened up today and I'm like, dying to show you it is so amazing um when lisa first got when she first got started in this she made one for princess adrian i don't know if it's like when she first got started or she wasn't she hadn't done it too long and she actually sent one to princess adrian i want to say almost two years ago but that's probably wrong but that's my mind and that's how it works mm -hmm. yep but it has been quite some time but she made Adrian this one. It says Princess Adrian, and of course, lighting is going to glare on it, but it is very sparkly. It's got both big and little glitter in there, and her name, and it has Cinderella, because at the time, Lisa asked Adrian what her favorite princess was, and or who it was, and Adrian said Cinderella, but for all of you who know Adrienne, if you ask her every single week, it's different. Yes, so when people ask me who's Adrienne's favorite princess, I just say all of them because they legit are. Depends on what kind of mood she's in this week. Um, let's see. I can't remember which one was second. Oh, I think in this one. This one. This one has my name on it and it resembles the Minnie Mouse Cupcake Backpack which I should have got down to show you, but that's what this is. And it's got the frosting on top and even on the very top of it. And it's got Minnie Mouse's polka dots and it is so smooth and beautiful. And it's got really fine, let me see if you can see it, really fine sparkly glitter in there, which I don't mind. I really like sparkle stuff like that because it's very easy to clean. Everyone's all, why do you not like sparkle bags? Because they're sequins. And have you ever tried to put a Swiffer over the top of sequins? That's why. Okay. The next one, Lisa did for us a giveaway for Autism Awareness back in April. 
Oh, well, we did the giveaway, but she made the prize. And then it was one like this. It was similar, not quite the same, but similar. It was Autism Awareness. This one she actually made for Princess Adrian and I, which I'm really, really glad because I absolutely love it. But it's got bigger chunks of glitter in it. And the Autism Awareness symbol in the Mickey head with the love. And here in light blue letters, it says accept, understand, and love. Which, yes, is true. Lisa also makes these really cute straw keepers. And this one, of course, is Minnie Mouse's hat. And it's got a little bit of, um, what do you call it? Like a uh, pearlescent maybe? Not so much glitter, but it's kind of like, got like a pearlescent kind of feel to it. I think I'm saying that right. I don't know. But you get the gist. It's shiny. Okay. Now this one is Adrian's favorite. And this was Adrian's birthday present from Lisa. And it says, Born to Sparkle. It has the chunkier glitter on the bottom and the finer glitter on the top in the silver and the white and the pink and the silver on the bottom. And it has all these little stars and stuff on it, pink and blue, and Princess Adrian on there. She also made Adrian a straw keeper in pink. And this one is glittery to match the mug, which I can't get on there. There we go. There it is. Yes. It's so pretty, and I love the colors in this one. These are very much some of Adrian's favorite colors. And this is definitely her favorite mug. Now, the funny thing about this mug, it has never been used. Adrian will not allow it to be used. Um, we have a little setup in our dining room where we have like little um, repurposed boxes that have been turned into shelves, like crates and uh, Coca Cola wooden crates and stuff that we've turned into shelves. And we have these sitting on there. And this one, if it is not just the right way, if it's not showing this in the front, she will turn it. Like if I dust it off or whatever, she will move it. It's absolutely her favorite. And this one, I got to tell you, it is so smooth and so well done. I, I, I'm with Adrian. I just absolutely love it. And I love this type of closer too. Cause you could, you don't need the straw. You can drink it like with coffee. That's what I love about my cupcake one, or you can have the straw. Okay. The next one Chris actually got for, she actually made this for Chris. Is it? Yes, it is. Wow, I'm going through these ten kind of fast. I hope I'm not going too fast because they're amazing. I hope I'm doing them justice. Order one and you will see. They are awesome. Okay, this one she just did for Chris. Um, well, we ordered this one for Chris for Father's Day. Um, as you, for those of you who know me, know that I am a proud Air Force mom. Um, our son Matthew is serving uh, in the United States Air Force. He is in aerospace propulsions. He is a flight line um, engines mechanic for the mechanic for the E-15 Strike Eagles. Some serious business. Very very proud mom. Let me tell you. And very proud dad. Which is why this one was made for Chris for Father's Day. And it is a mug. I don't know if you can read it all, but it says most people never meet their hero. I raised mine. Proud Air Force Dad. I just got a little emotional. Did you see that? I just choked up. <sighs> anyway, this is perfect. There is no glitter on this one. So she didn't have to put extra epoxy layers on this. So this one is like really, really light. Um, and it has the spin kind of closure on this one where you can close it like this. And he can drink that like a cup of coffee. Because, you know, this is what he drinks out of it, is coffee. So it's perfect. I love it. And Chris loves it too. Can't wait for Matthew to see it. But now, Lisa just recently, like I said, opened her Etsy shop. And again, I'll have that link below. Go check it out now. But you'll have to keep refreshing and keep looking because she's adding stuff. And it is disappearing as quick as she can add it. I'm part of the reason because I love her stuff. I am I am not exaggerating, not kidding, and her prices are amazing. 
but she just made this one, put it on her channel, and I grabbed it. Look at this! Oh my gosh, isn't it so pretty? My favorite color is navy blue, so this is perfect, and you all know my favorite character. So I just loved it, and I have to tell you, after getting this, this is my favorite size. I think I really like this size. It's easy to hold. I have arthritis in my hands. So this is really easy to hold. Yeah, I'm going to have to say that this is. It's got one of these closures that you just snap it shut, open it, and I love it. I love it with my cold beverages just as much as with my hot beverages. It's really, really good. Really, really nice. I just realized, oh my gosh, I just realized there's like little, I'm sorry, I had an aha moment. Um, I'm taking you along for the ride. But there's like these little hearts. I don't know if you guys can see them. Hold on. Can you see them? There's like these little sparkle hearts in there. Oh my gosh, I don't know if you can see them. I have got to get better lighting. Let me see if I can find some more. They're all over, but they're going to be just as hard to see. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love it, Lisa. I absolutely love it. Lisa doesn't just make tumblers. She also makes earrings. Um, she's getting ready to do uh, writing pens. Um, she does all kinds of stuff. So I'm really excited to see what she does with her channel. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Oh, she does air freshener little thingies. All kinds of fun stuff. I told her this is going to be my new obsession. You know, look out, lounge fly. We're moving to the tumblers. Yeah, they're just that cool. Oh, and my mom wants one, and uh, my friend wants one, and yeah, I want like 10 more. I'm very excited, can you tell? But I love Sunday River tumblers. Please check them out. They are absolutely amazing. Yeah. Thomas, thank you so much for allowing me to participate in Small Shop Saturdays. It is such a pleasure, and I am so impressed with what you're doing. It's my pleasure to come on board. Thank you so much. In the meantime, I want all of you to have a wonderful afternoon, have a good day, and as Adrian would say, remember, be yourself. Bye!